Okay, the other way is with these sheets. I have a bunch of these. So if I want my handle about this high, the sheets come out this big. I can cut it down so it's that tall. And what you can do is you can roll it up. Just roll it. There we go. I just rolled it around a couple times so it's, so it's uh, stiff. Cut off the excess. And you can use either gelatin or piping gel to get it to stick to itself. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to use gelatin. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, heat up that gelatin that I had earlier. It only takes a little bit. Let me heat this up. I hope I can do that. Woohoo! Excellent. Okay, so it heated up. You can see there's a little tiny bit in there. Where is it? So I get this little piece. You just roll it up, and right here, I'm going to use my finger. I'm just going to put gelatin and coat all the way down here and hold it. Now you can put a rubber band on it, or um, you can just wait a few seconds. It only takes a few seconds, and it'll stick to itself. Okay? It sticks to itself. Okay. But that's not actually, a, I mean, a handle. It's, it's just a rod right now. So gelatin off my fingers. I still need the other two pieces, so I need to roll. <sighs> roll it again. And you can use all your practice pieces that weren't good enough to go around your cake. That's what, that's what I was doing, was using my practice pieces. And I'm actually going to cut this in half. As you can see, it cuts very easily. Whoops, that one broke. That's too long too. Just you want to cut it to the size you want for sticking out from. How far out do you want it to stick from the mug? So you know how far out do I want to stick? And see, they they do they break. It's not a big deal. Just roll it up, put a little gel on it, stick it. Whoops, stick it together. I put it on the wrong side. <laughs> Put it on the right side. Okay, so it sticks. And then, again, a little bit of gel, this uh, gelatin, and you just stick it on there. And it'll actually stick to itself. Okay, and I can do another one down here. And I've already done one, but you can see you could just build your own, build your own handle. And it looks like, you know, it's going to look like the glass. Hopefully that was clear. Let me show you what I got. I think I have one, yeah. It came out okay. You know, this is basically what I ended up with. Okay. A handle. It looks like a handle. I mean, it's okay. I like the pewter one better, but if you really want a glass handle, this is one way to do it. The other way to get a glass handle is to um, mold. Put it, find a mold or make a mold to make a handle and line it with gelatin. Okay? That's another class. <laughs> Okay, so there's, there's, a ways, there's ways to do a handle. Now gelatin, this is really lightweight, so it'll stick to itself. So again, I can use the gelatin and just put some on here and stick it onto the side of my cake and it'll stay. Okay, I'll go through both of those in a minute.